My name is Wande Abimbola, and I'm the spokesperson of Yoruba religion in the world. My wife is Adishebo Abimbola, who is one of the three ambassadors of Yoruba religion in the world. I bring, bring greetings. I bring greetings from Ileife, the home, the ancestral home of the Yoruba people of West Africa in Nigeria, which is also the place of origin of their religion. Yoruba religion originated in West Africa, but is now a property of the whole world. It is a religion that is based on respect. Respect for children, for women, for elders, for brothers and sisters. We respect not only human persons, but animals, trees, all the forces of nature, rivers, oceans, rocks, mountains, trees, insects, everything that is on the surface of this earth is alive. It is stupid to divide the world into living and non-living things. There is no such thing as a non-living thing. Anything that is on the surface of this earth or inside the earth is alive. The earth itself is a woman, and she is our mother. Unless and until human persons grapple with the fact that we are part and parcel of nature, we are no higher than nature, this earth on which we live and who nourishes us will always be at pain. Every day we inflict pain, horrible pain on our mother because of the fact this fallacy that human persons are higher than nature. I invite the leaders of all the other religions of the world, whether Christian or Muslim, Hindu or whatever, to ponder on this fact that the most important thing we need is respect for the entire creation. La lege, la lege, O ni se gbagbo o ni kirun la lege ola re le mi oje 
the most powerful divinity in our crowded pantheon of divinities is Oya, hey, and she is a woman. Let us salute her by saying, hey, Oya, hey, Oya, Oya is the tornado. She is the hurricane, but she is also the Niger River, which passes through a good part of the African continent. She was a mother. She was a queen, a wife, a king in her own right. She's everything that a woman can never dream to be. She is also the buffalo. She was a buffalo before she became a human person. Let us give respect to our women and our mothers. of the Yorubas traveled during the long years of the Atlantic slave trade to the Americas. And it's now practiced by millions of people in Brazil, in Trinidad and Tobago, in Cuba, in a lot of the West Indies. And it is a religion that does not know any boundaries of color. Today, there are millions of white folks who are priests and priestesses of the Yoruba religion, like my wife. It is time for the world to share itself of the bigotry of color. We have had more than 2,000 years of hatred, of war, of pestilence, of slavery. Let us try a little bit of friendship. Today, the religion of the Yorubas is blossoming all over the world without the need for any centralized organization, without the need for any proselytization. If your holy book, I respect all the holy books of the Quran, of the Bible, of the Riveda, and so on and so forth. If your holy book teaches you to go and bring the good tidings of your religion to other peoples, do it with a lot of respect. There is no longer any time left for conquests. There is no time, any time left for a way to convert other people against their will. Oh, 
Oni mo se bi fa gun ni Mo se bi fa gun ni Mo se bi fa gun ni Bo pele baba gun mi ma gbede bo stamp your feet Mo se bi fa gun ni say that Mo se bi fa gun ni ogun mi Mo se bi fa gun ni Ogun mi mo se bi fa gun ni Ogun mi mo se bi fa gun ni Oh, oh, te o ni fa o O te kun ugo O te o ni fa O te kun ugo Ti te la te di ogbe Te mori wogbo Mose e bi fa aguni Mose bi fa aguni Bo kwe le baba gun mi ma gbe de bo run Mose bi fa guni Ogun mi Mose bi fa guni Ogun mi Mose bi fa guni Ogun mi Mose bi fa guni Oni ba ba ron lor ron eni soro soro la da Adwa fon or umi la Ifan lor le ebe gun gun mo le La ba la Mo be gun gun mo le Mo di win Or umi la E la so de Ifan alo be gun gun mo le La ba la Mo be gun gun mo le Mo di win Oni mo be gun gun mo le Se mo di win Oh 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 Mo be gun gun mo le Mo di win Oru me la E la so di Ifa alo be gun gun mo le La ba la Mo be gun gun mo le Se mo di win That last chant says I have made a covenant with my ancestors and as a result I have become immortal Asher. if I says anybody who makes a covenant with his ancestors shall never die thank you very much Asher.